I literally have no idea where it is and I tried googling it several times and nobody has an exact address but I'm pretty sure it's going to be over here somewhere. Oh, there. there it is. There. memorial where he was murdered it's been five years it's been five years since the last time I was here I was here for the protest I was protesting five years ago I can't believe it's been five years part of me feels like where did the time go they put a plaque which is nice because um, before they had like a makeshift memorial with all the teddy bears and all the stuff like in the street or whatever. And so now they have like an actual plaque like in the ground in the sidewalk, like something permanent, which is good. I was just looking at the pictures in the video from five years ago. There was like some shrubs and stuff that they removed, but like aside from that, the apartments, everything looks, the apartments and everything looks exactly the same. And it's like people walking by and like cars going by and what's wild to me is like and everybody has been black and it's like people still have to live here. Like people still live here and no justice was ever served. Like Darren Wilson got off, he wasn't convicted of anything. You know. Like I'm glad there's a plaque here, but a part of me feels like I wonder if it's even like wor not worse, but like harder. Is now supplied that these people got to walk past every day about what happened here and he's got to keep living here in these apartments like nothing happened and driving through Ferguson to get here everything looks exactly the same as five years ago they were talking about oh we're gonna make all these changes and we're gonna revitalize but like all the money all the efforts all the donations should just be disappearing you have no idea where anything goes where any resources go you come back and everything is exactly the same. I was reading an article where they were talking about how all the quote unquote revitalization efforts have gone to like other parts of like Ferguson and like other parts of St. Louis. Cause we was over in some other parts of St. Louis yesterday that looked very nice. Nothing but white people walking around. That's where all the money and the resources go. Like, that's what it is. They're like, oh, we're gonna revitalize. We're gonna do this and do that and be bullshit they're gonna take all the money and resources that's supposed to be for here for what happened here for what happened to Mike Brown here his killer gonna get away scot-free and then they're gonna sink that into white people neighborhoods where they don't even need it that shit's whack but that's the system I'm not surprised so I also want to say and that's why black people can't rely on the system why I keep talking about like ejecting from the system, getting around the system, independent communities outside the system, because the system is racist on all levels. Even what's supposed to happen after the racist murder is still racist. Like, they take the resources and put them somewhere else for white people, that's just crazy. And everything over here looks exactly the same, except now they got a plaque here commemorating that Mike Brown was killed here, lynched, his body left in the street for hours. But I'm glad that I got to come here and see this on the five year anniversary, I guess you could say. That's it.